Hi everyone, today we will see the topic transistor and amplifier. So as we know uh, there are two types of transistor, one is NPN transistor, the other one is uh, PNP transistor. So the transistor in which one type, one P type material is placed between two N type material is known as a NPN transistor. So this transistor in which one N type material is doped with two P type materials. So such type of transistor is known as PNP transistor. So what are the three basic uh, configuration of a transistor? So we have come across common base, common emitter and common collector which is commonly used in electronic circuits. So all the three transistor configurations are used in various applications of electronic circuits. How the transistor acts as an amplifier? So a transistor acts as an amplifier by raising the strength of a weak signal and also a small input voltage results in a large output voltage which shows that the transistor works as an amplifier. When can the transistor be used as an amplifier? So when the most common function of a transistor is to be used in common emitter mode. So what are the difference between transistor and amplifier? So a transistor work either as an amplifier or you can say a switch. So when it works as an amplifier, it takes in, the, in a tiny electric current at one end as an input current and produces a much bigger electric current as an output current at the other. So how do transistor amplify signals? So a transistor acts as an amplifier by raising the strength of a weak signal. So what is faithful amplification? The process of raising the strength of a weak signal without any change in its general shape. It is known as a faithful amplification. And what is transistor biasing? So the transistor biasing is the process of providing DC voltage which helps in the functioning of the circuit. So what do you mean by bias stabilizer? The process of making operating point independent of temperature parameter variations or transistor replacement is called the bias stabilization. Thank you.